What's up guys, my name is Ace, and we now have 100% confirmation that it's Black Ops 4 this time around with Treyarch's Call of Duty. We got this official confirmation as well as this teaser that I'm going to be playing a little bit in the background here. And we got some very important information. First off, we're going to be having a community reveal event May 17th this year. And then something really big and definitely out of the ordinary, the launch date for this Call of Duty is going to be October 12th. Normally Call of Duty doesn't launch until the first week of November, so this is definitely a big surprise to a lot of people. It came kind of out of nowhere, but it looks like we're getting Call of Duty about a month early this year. Now with this teaser, we didn't get much information on what the game is going to be like by any means. That's the kind of stuff that is definitely going to be teased between now and that community event on May 17th. I'm sure some of those details will come out between now and then. But as of right now, basically all we know is that it's called Black Ops 4, this is the logo, and there was one thing towards the end of the teaser that said, forget everything you know. So we don't have any indication on the setting, or the timeline, or the movement system, or anything along those lines for this upcoming Call of Duty game. We have very little information at this point. But I did want to make sure for those of you guys that live under a rock that Black Ops 4 is officially confirmed now, and the leaks were in fact true. And of course, this is always really exciting news every year when you find out what the next Call of Duty game is going to be. Now, I've already had a few people tweeting me and asking me, why would they release it this early? Why are they releasing it a month early compared to what they normally do? And I strongly suspect this is to throw a bit of a curveball to Battlefield this year, because Battlefield is going to have a game coming out this year, it looks like. And traditionally, Battlefield launches their game towards the end of October, and they always try to beat Call of Duty by two to three weeks. And I feel this does help them quite a bit. It's one of the reasons I buy Battlefield every single time, because I'm waiting for Call of Duty and the hype and the excitement is killing me, so I buy Battlefield so I can kill the time for those last couple of weeks until Call of Duty launches, and then I pretty much never touch that Battlefield game again. I'm not saying everybody does this, but I do feel that impacts their sales a decent amount, and it looks like Call of Duty's throwing a curveball to them this year, and they may be launching first. Regardless of the reason for this, I am extremely excited that we're actually one month closer to the next Call of Duty than we all expected, and that's great for me. Now that's not to say that I'm not enjoying myself with World War II at all, and that you're only going to be seeing Black Ops 4 related content between now and then, absolutely not. We'll be returning to the regular World War II schedule tomorrow, but as time goes on and as we get substantial information, I will be covering Black Ops 4 news and information as we go on. But the key word there is substantial. I don't want to be one of those YouTubers that covers every single tweet or little tidbit of information or a little leak or anything like that. I don't want to jump on that stuff, but the big stuff I'll definitely be covering on this channel. And with that, I want to wrap up this really quick update video for you guys. Just wanted to share that quick information just in case you guys haven't seen it elsewhere. And also just share my general thoughts on Black Ops 4. I am really excited for the idea, although we really need more information. I, I gotta know, is it boots on the ground? Is it advanced movement? Is it modern day, slightly near future, or far future? What's the deal here? That's the stuff I'm really looking forward to. But I expect that will start to be leaked and revealed as time goes on between now and May 17th. So with that, we're going to wrap up this super quick update video. I'd love to know in the comment section below, of course, what do you guys think about Black Ops 4? I know I kind of asked a similar question yesterday, but that's when it was all like rumored and leaked and everything. Now it's actually confirmed. Are you excited? Are you disappointed? Do you want advanced movement? Do you want boots on the ground? Let me know down below. If you enjoyed the video, a like rating is always appreciated. And don't forget to subscribe for more if you haven't already. I'll talk to you guys next time.